Your gallbladder is a small, pear-shaped organ under your liver. It's connected to your digestive tract through a tube known as the bile duct. The main purpose of the gallbladder is to store bile that's produced in the liver. Bile helps the body digest fat through a process known as emulsification. When you have a meal that has fat in it, the gallbladder contracts and empties the bile into your digestive tract. There are several situations where you may need to have your gallbladder removed. The most common reason is gallstones. Gallstones are stones made from the constituents of bile that form inside your gallbladder. They may cause pain, fever, yellowish discoloration of your body and other symptoms. If you would like to know more about this, you can watch my video on gallstones. The gallbladder may also be removed due to a cancer in the gallbladder. Removal of the gallbladder does not affect your digestion much. Although some people develop symptoms like gas or bloating, they usually get better. The surgery to remove your gallbladder is known as cholecystectomy. There are two main ways of removing the gallbladder, open and laparoscopic. In laparoscopic cholecystectomy, the surgeon uses a special camera to see inside your abdomen and to perform the surgery. Because of this, he only needs to make a few small cuts in your abdomen. My video on laparoscopic and minimally invasive surgery has more information on this subject. During an open cholecystectomy, the surgeon places a single long incision on your abdomen to perform the surgery. Removing the gallbladder is a safe procedure and one of the commonest surgeries performed worldwide. The chance of complications after this surgery is small, but the complications may include the following. Damage to the bile ducts, a bile leak, injury to the bowels, infection or bleeding. If you had a laparoscopic cholecystectomy, you can have a light diet when you wake up. You will be able to go home the next day. If you had an open cholecystectomy, you will be in hospital for a few days. If you develop any of the following symptoms during the first few weeks after your surgery, you need to contact your doctor immediately. Fever and chills Shredness around the cuts from your surgery, severe nausea or vomiting, severe pain in your abdomen, yellowish discoloration of your skin or eyes, or dark urine. For more videos like this, please visit my YouTube channel or Facebook page. If you would like to know more about this or have any questions, please leave a comment below. You could also comment on any topics you would like me to cover in the future. Thank you.